This video of the planned extension of Alkane Resources' Tommingley Gold Project represents one possible development scenario. Ongoing consultation with a wide range of people and stakeholders will help shape the final project development design. The Tommingley Gold Project is located about five hours' drive west of Sydney. Discovered by Alkane in the 2000s, the project was developed in 2013 and has been pouring gold on site since early 2014. The mine site straddles the Newell Highway and ore is transported through a purpose-built underpass. Open pit mining finished in 2019 and mining has transitioned to an underground operation beneath the open pit at Wyoming 1. In recent years, Alkane has discovered substantial mineralization to the south of the mine, in particular at the Roswell and San Antonio deposits. Both of these are within five kilometers of the operating processing plant and are proposed to be developed to extend the mine life of the operations at Tommingley. The red shapes shown here represent the location of the underground gold mineralization if it was vertically projected to the surface. The mineralization inside the existing open pits has been largely mined out. The waste rock from the mine has been placed and shaped into two landforms to the east and north of the existing mine. Using environmental best practices, the rehabilitation of the waste rock emplacements with established vegetation is largely complete. Built in 2013, the processing facility is capable of milling over 1 million tonnes of ore per year and passes it through a conventional cyanide leach process to recover the gold. The gold is poured at site before being securely transported to a refinery. The tailings are sent through a cyanide destruction circuit before being stored in a conventional residue storage facility. The four mined open pits are substantial deposits that continue at depth. Wyoming 3 has been progressively backfilled as part of rehabilitation for the site. A portion of each of the resources continues under each open pit. The Wyoming 1 deposit is currently being mined underground beneath the mined out pit and continued underground mining is planned for the years ahead. The currently planned underground development and stopes will be mined using conventional modern underground mining methods. Ore is hauled by trucks up the decline and to the processing plant. With a large volume of material in excess of 2 grams per tonne of gold, the resource is well suited to underground extraction. The resource is both open at depth and a long strike to the south, so future extensions to the Wyoming 1 underground mine are possible. Development has commenced to join the Wyoming 1 decline to the planned underground mining beneath the Coloma and Coloma 2 open pits. Numerous stopes are planned at both Coloma and Coloma 2, targeting the higher grade sections of the underground ore body. Both deposits have high grade chutes, substantial resources and are open at depth and along strike. The existing Tommingley Gold operations have sizable underground mining planned and have potential to grow as they are further developed in the years ahead. An approved exploration drive is planned from Wyoming 1 to the Roswell deposit, the historic Miles United Mine, which produced approximately 70,000 ounces, is a planned exploration target. Roswell has numerous high-grade intercepts and has a defined inferred resource of 7 million tonnes at 2 grams per tonne for 445,000 contained ounces of gold. The Roswell resource is open at depth and a long strike. The San Antonio ore body is closer to the surface than Roswell and has several distinct high-grade plunging chutes. San Antonio has an inferred resource of 7.9 million tonnes at 1.8 grams per tonne for 453,000 contained ounces of gold. The San Antonio resource is also open at depth and a long strike. Infill and extensional drilling at Roswell and San Antonio is expected to result in updated resources in late 2020. Conceptual mine plans have been prepared for community, stakeholder and regulatory consultation. More detailed mine plans will follow as the resources become further defined and feedback from consultation is received. The current conceptual plan consists of one open pit approximately 1,700 metres long and 700 metres wide as well as underground mining planned beneath the pit. Waste rock emplacements to the east and west of the potential open pits are being considered. 
Water diversion structures would be required at their base and more generally around the site and the Newell Highway. To develop the deposits as proposed, the Newell Highway would need to be diverted. An initial concept is shown here. With substantial resources beneath the mined out open pits and also to the south at San Antonio and Roswell, it is an exciting time as this development has the potential to extend the life of the mine and employment at the Tommingley Gold operation for years to come. Alkane looks forward to ongoing community consultation and continuing a safe and environmentally friendly operation while progressing the development of its extensive exploration discoveries.